Jesus Christ, the God who is worth serving. Let's dive into today's Bible study and talk about why we need God to change our hearts. People think that humans are just inherently good and they're inherently moral. Then why do people lie, destroy, steal, cheat? Why do people do these things if we were all just inherently good? Let's dive into the Bible and see what it says about this. It says it right here. So I say, let the Holy Spirit guide your lives. Then you won't be doing what your sinful nature craves. Guys, it's undeniable that humans get tempted towards sin. It's undeniable. So we need God to help us through the... It says again right here, the human heart is the most deceitful of all things and desperately wicked. Who really knows how bad it is? But guys... Here's the good news. Here's the beautiful part about Jesus. It says right here, and I will give you a new heart and I will put a new spirit in you. Talking about the Holy Spirit. I will take out your stony, stubborn heart and give you a tender, responsive heart. Did he say we earn that heart? Did he say if you do enough good deeds, if you, if you tell enough people nice things, then you get that heart? No, he very clearly says he gives it to you. It's a gift. It's not something we're earning. That's the beautiful thing about true Christianity is we don't earn our way into heaven. We're not earning it. We love Jesus. We serve Jesus. Jesus was the ultimate sacrifice for you, for me. He loves us so much. He was willing to give everything up just so we could have an opportunity to feel the Holy Spirit and go to heaven and be with him for eternity. People consider themselves good people, but they still lie sometimes. They still cheat sometimes. They still do these things. And that doesn't mean you're not a good person, but it just reveals that we do have desires sometimes that are not of God. So let's jump back to it, guys. Let the Holy Spirit guide your life. Who is guiding your life? Where are you drawing your strength from? Where are you getting your joy from? Where are you getting your power from? Because if you're just relying on people, if you're just relying on yourself, you'll fall short every single time. You know why? Because God never fails. God never fails. If you want to feel the Holy Spirit in your life, if you want a new heart, if you want Jesus to give you a new heart, I want to encourage you to seek his face. That means reading your Bible. That means praying. That means putting in an active effort to get closer to God. Listen, I love you guys so much. Make sure to hit that follow button. Check out my new gym vlog, my new music on Spotify. Jesus is truth. Jesus Christ is the only way to heaven. Jesus Christ is the God I serve. I love you guys. Peace.